there are a lot of interesting reports out there. And if you have time, and I don't think most people do, you begin to look at these reports of Ukrainian gains, you discover that in many cases, the areas where they are claiming that they made gains are nowhere near the battlefield. They're not even in the security zone. And a few times they'll point to some ruined buildings, two or three at a time inside the security zone. And that's this 15 to 25 kilometer stretch of territory beyond the main defensive belt that the Russians have constructed. So I would tell you there would be no gains at all because everything always hinged on the ability of the Ukrainian counteroffensive to reach the main defensive belt, crack it, move through it in order to reach something of importance like Melitopol. It hasn't happened. And we're now at least 11 days into what the Ukrainians said would be a two-week offensive. How much they've got left is anybody's guess. The last time I looked, there were supposedly still 12 brigades in reserve. Now, are those full-strength brigades? Or, you know, conceivably, that could be 60,000 men if they're up to 5,000 each. Or are they 4,000? Are they 3,000, 2,000? I don't know. But at this stage of the game, they have not yet committed those last remaining reserves.